Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel. And uh, well, there's a uh, tool that showed up during the weekend. It is not an official tool and it's downloadable on GitHub. And it's called Why Not Windows 11. And this is a tool that will check your machine and be a little more, actually a lot more precise than the tool Microsoft gives and telling you why your computer cannot run Windows 11. I'm going to talk more about Windows 11 and the requirements because a lot of people uh, feel that they are left off. So anyways, first the tool and how to download it and the warnings that you'll get when you download actually. So I'll share the link to this page. When you go down, you'll see something called, uh, well, what is called Why Not Win 11. This is the file that you need. This is what it looks like when it does the check of what is compatible on your computer or not. So you have, you know, green for it's okay, red, you're missing some something, or yellow, it it's not sure if it's gonna be compatible or not. So you go down this page, you click on why not win11.exe. Here, it's gonna wanna download, but it's gonna say, uh, this has been blocked because it could harm your device. And the reason it does that, it's what we call smart screen, which is something that checks your downloads to a known download list of files. So right now it's gonna tell you, I don't know what it is exactly. So that's why you have to just bypass this. So what you do when that happens here, you just go on the three dots and you say keep. Then you'll of course have another warning. This might ha actually arm your device. Don't worry, it's not going to arm your device. It's, uh, it's a known, correct, um, executable. You just say keep anyway. It's gonna download. Once it's on your PC, you'll have one last warning. When you actually wanna open it, you're going to have Windows protected your PC. Smart screen prevented an unrecognized app from starting. Once again, more info and run anyway. What it's gonna do, it's gonna bring up this app and it's going to do a check of all of your computer and give you what is wrong, why is Windows not compatible with your computer or not. So here it's checking all the different options of my PC it's telling me it's okay. It's still checking for the DirectX WDDM2. And here we go. Everything is okay on this PC. On the other PC that I actually have checked to see if I could, why I could not upgrade, for example, uh, it uh, simply said that my TPM was missing. And in fact, that older PC has been built in a time when, yep, there was no TPM or, or Intel integrated um, equivalent to this um, security check. So this tool is much more precise because it's going to tell you exactly why your computer is not compatible with the uh, Windows 11. A lot of people go crazy on TPM, but I can tell you TPM is not the reason the majority of uh, a lot of people won't be able to run Windows 11. We're focusing on the wrong problem. TPM has been integrated in most uh, processors, Intel and AMD Ryzen processors in the last few years. If you bought a PC and your processor is of a generation that is only a year, two years ago, you have TPM. It's just not enabled it's integrated within the CPU. But if your computer's older, if your computer you know, dates more than about four years, five years, you're out of luck. You're going to be in a um, situation where often your processor is not capable of running and TPM is, might not be updated. So you know, when I see people saying, well, you can just you know, bypass the TPM. If you don't have a TPM, Chances are other parts of your PC are not compatible anyways. So even if you would bypass, it still wouldn't work. So uh, anyways, this is the, the thing to check out. Why not Win 11? 
don't worry about the warnings it's because this is an unknown app so windows just doesn't want you to run things that it doesn't know where it is or where it comes from but it's safe uh the link to the download is in the description below the video once again all you have to do when you get to the page is go down and click why not win 11.exe if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching